The boy accidentally picked up a mysterious giant egg. He curiously pried it open with a knife. It turned out to be a blue unidentified object inside. Curiosity drove the boy to open it again with a knife. Soon I found the mysterious lines on the egg. At this time the boy's mother called him outside. He put down his tools and ran out. But it didn't take long for the egg to move on its own. At night. Thunder and lightning. It started raining heavily. Then the boy suddenly remembered about the egg. He ran to the abandoned warehouse under the torrential rain. However, as soon as he entered the door, he found. The egg is missing. Only the shed eggshells fell to the ground. Suddenly the boy heard a strange sound. He is a little scared. Stood up slowly. Walked carefully to the shelf. As the voice becomes clearer. He walked to a corner. Slowly poke away the plants. A little monster is there. Pretty cute. The boy was cute by him. Want to reach out and touch it. In the end, I didn't expect this little thing to be fierce. He went back and got a potato. Then cut into slices. Feed this little monster. The boy was the first creature the little monster saw. So he is very dependent on boys. The boy is called Xiao Yu. He also named the little monster Xiao Ni. Since then, he started raising nuns. The vegetables he moved to the house are going to feed Xiao Ni. Who knows this guy is tall though. But the appetite is really big. A while. Xiao Ni ate all the leaves. Xiao Yu is a little surprised. Can he hold his stomach so small? He touched Xiao Ni's body, but found it was very dry. Yu Xiao Yu found a big bucket. Xiao Ni swims happily inside. This day, the boy just came downstairs. Suddenly there was an exclamation from upstairs. He hurried up to take a look. It turned out that my sister found Xiao Ni. In just a few days, Nicholas has grown up several times. He begged his sister not to tell her mother about Xiao Ni. Sister is also very curious about this thing. Promised him. But Xiao Ni will be in love when he is hungry. The cry attracted the little repairman invited by his mother. Man pushes the door in. The siblings greet each other with smiles. Cover up panic. Who knows that taking Xiao Ni to reveal his head by himself. But the repairman did not show a surprised expression. It turns out that the uncle Shusui has a lot of knowledge. There has always been a local legend. There is a giant water monster in this water area, hermaphrodite. An egg will be left just before s. So every new water monster is an orphan. At this moment, my mother's voice came. The repairer also agreed to help them hide from their mother. When the mother walked into the bathroom, Xiao Ni has long been gone. It turns out he hid Niu in the toilet. One wave has not settled, another wave has risen. The quiet eyes were broken by a sudden army. Woman dumbfounded. The army in front of you turned out to be the Royal Legion. The Legion should use there. But they don't know. The boy secretly raised an ancient mythical beast. Soon the army moved to the boy's house. They also held a small party in the evening. The taste of the food at the party attracted little knee. I saw it ran out of the room with small steps. But was blocked by a military dog. He hurried back and ran. But the dog SS chased him from behind. In the lobby, the dog ran to the restaurant table. The soup on the table has been turned dry. Turning around, the dog ran outside. But found out that Xiao Ni was gone. It turns out that the clever little Ni is disguised as a statue. After the army dog is gone. He looked back at the fish pond on the side. He plopped and jumped in. A whole pond of small goldfish becomes Xiao Ni's delicacy. The next day, the repairer found that Xiao Ni had eaten last night. Actually grows bigger than human beings. This body shape must not be able to hide. So the uncle took Xiao Yu and brought little Ni to the lake. Uncle hugged him hard. But Xiao Ni didn't want to leave anyhow. He can't bear Xiao Yu. Xiao Ni's eyes have been looking in the direction of the master. The man took out his favorite potato milk to the distance. Xiao Yu ran back while Xiao Ni turned around. A few days later, two old men came to this waters to fish. They seemed to have fallen into a behemoth. The man followed and looked into the water. Suddenly Xiao Ni poked his head out. This time scared the old man. Then he took the fishing boat and ran for three times. The boat began to drive fast on the surface. Eventually break the fishing line. The boat was able to stop. And these two old people recalled the little knee just now. I think I found some treasure. Xiao Yu misses Xiao Ni very much this day. He came to the lake, rowing a small boat and came to the middle of the lake. She waited on the lake for a long time. Xiao Ni appeared from behind. And now he has become very huge. Xiao Ni obediently put his head in front of Xiao Yu. Then Xiao Ni put him on his back. He took Xiao Yu and made waves in the lake. Although Xiao Yu was dripping when he was a child. An inexplicable fear of water. But there is a sense of security on Xiao Ni's back. He grabbed Xiao Ni's back and saw the world at the bottom of the lake. Soon he sent Xiao Yu back to the shore. And the military dog in the distance came looking for a smell. 
and the accompanying officer also saw this scene, really, the next day, they used the excuse of military exercises, began to fire violently at the lake. Nicholas kept avoiding cannonball attacks in the water. Xiaoyu stepped forward to stop him desperately. The officer was angry at the kid breaking into the exercise position, but he reluctantly terminated the exercise, but what they didn't know was completely irritated this time. Two old people are photographing the Loch Ness Monster, because the real monster hasn't shown up. They had to tie up a fake with straw. When the shutter is pressed, they think they are rich. Soon the photos spread all over the world. Of course it also passed to the army. The commander decided to catch him. Night. Xiao Yu came to the lake. He wants to inform Xiao Ni to leave here. He yelled several times towards the lake. But no response. Suddenly Xiao Ni suddenly appeared. It will attack the two with its mouth open. He was stimulated by the army's attack that day. Xiao Yu stretched out his hand to relax him. Xiao Ni closed his eyes too. But at this moment there was a sudden thunder in the sky. Nicholas once again remembered the cannonball that day. It goes back. Then disappeared to the surface. After the two left, the dog came to the lake again. People from the army are also fishing in the lake. Suddenly the water in front of the dog shook violently. A huge water monster appeared. The dog is gone. Shivering from being scared. The officer could not hear the dog barking in the distance. Feels weird. Sudden. The water suddenly turned up a huge wave. Little Ni is like a dragon vacating the water. They used machine guns to shoot. Xiao Ni quickly dived into the bottom of the lake. Aim the boat. Fly it directly. Seeing Xiao Ni is about to eat them. Xiao Yu on the shore stopped him. He started walking towards Xiao Ni. Tell him to calm down. Suddenly the boy slipped. Sink to the bottom of the lake. Xiao Ni regained his sanity upon seeing this. Immediately yelled the drowning small print. Put to the shore. Touch the master's hand tenderly. Xiao Yu wakes up. Reach out and touch him. The mother who rushed to see the scene was silly. He can't imagine that his son has such a big pet. Sudden. A cannonball exploded. Boy ran forward. Jump on Xiao Ni's body. The shore bombarded the water non-stop. Xiao Yu instructs Xiao Ni to avoid the cannonball attack. The two cooperated tacitly to avoid deadly attacks many times. Xiao Yu told Xiao Ni to take him to the sea. But the military blocked an iron net on the road. The huge net is like a scourge in front of you. Xiao Yu knows it's time to partake. Xiao Ni also looked back at the master. They know. I'll never see you again after I leave. Xiao Yu also knows that Xiao Ni should never be allowed to stay. Xiao Ni looked back at master for a long time. Then he dived into the water. Then start sprinting at full speed. One got up and jumped out of the water. It rushes to the sky like a dragon. The iron net broke directly under him. It will swim along this road to the sea. After a long time. Xiao Yu brought his family to the lake. That former partner Ni is far away. He glanced at his former master. With a loud roar. He jumped. Disappear into the vast lake. Well, this video ends here. Like friends, remember to like and follow the kiss. See you next time.